This week, we have the pleasure of hearing a wonderful poem from Brother Porter. Take it away, Brother Porter. Teens nowadays have no respect for school. A trade or education are against the rule. Sleeping in the day, running the streets at night, using or selling drugs, or looking for a fight. Rapping to the girls, call them bitches, call them hoes. Make them get a gig, buy your cars, buy your clothes. Running with the game, killing just for fun. Help them stop the violence, take away the guns. Walk around sagging, your pants below your ass. Hanging on the corner, flashing signs and smoking grass. Stake a piece of hood, claiming it to be your land. On a pretense of protecting your neighbors from your rival brother man. Disrespect your elders. Don't give a damn about the fuzz. Get upset when your parents want to know where you was. But who the ones you call when you're in jail or on the run? Help them stop the violence. Take away the guns. Family's thrown apart because the father's gone astray. Mom worked two jobs. Kids are lonely at home all day. Junior tried to help. Going to bring home some bread. He tries to rob a store. His victim winds up dead. They put the boy in jail, and in order to survive, he has to join a gang, or he too will die. The boy pays the price for the wrong the father's done. Help us stop the violence. Take away the guns. Crime is on the rise everywhere you go. Drug and prostitution is what makes the money flow. Destruction and control is the order of the day. We must take our street back, no matter what the price we pay. It starts with the father staying in the home. Mom can't work and raise the kid alone. Be a role model for your growing son. Help us stop the violence. Take away the guns. When families stay together and try to take a stand, the community joins in and lends a helping hand. The churches and the school get the attention of the young. We all pull together. The momentum now has swung. But we can't turn our backs on the ones who went astray. We must find a way to teach them there is another way. With God's help and a little luck, we can get it done. Yes, we can stop the violence if we take away the guns. Thank you for that inspirational poem. It gives us all a lot to think about. Until next week.